Cromwell, Connecticut, second round of the Travelers Championship. Take a look at Bubba Watson. He's missing the head of his driver. This is at the second, started on the back nine. Now we know he likes to unleash the power with the driver, but with that broken head, he had to go to the reserve. And so that Bubba pink headed driver was put to the side. He wasn't done though, set himself up for birdie. After that tee shot, drops it in. So after making the turn in one under, he would get to two under par on the day. The three time winner not done though. Take a look at this tee shot at five. Bubba with a long iron off the tee. And this one with a little top spin on it. And he just keeps sending it closer to the cup. And that would lead to an easy birdie. So he would pick up birdies at two and five, another at six. And how about making it three in a row for the three time champion here? This at seven from 50 feet away. Listen to the roar from the crowd. They went nuts for Bubba. Off the green, Patrick Reed at nine, and a nice little chasing chip shot from the edge. That one goes in as he moves to four under. Another player looking to make a move this week, Justin Rose. Former FedEx Cup champion looking for birdie at 11, looking to get in contention heading into the weekend. That would take him to seven under par. Good looking card as he goes out in 30. Scotty Scheffler, three under, working 10. Flat stick from off the green. That's in. His third, and that helps him move to four under par. Now Rose at 14. 33 footer, uphill, just a slight break, and he's got the line. The Englishman going to eight under par, ultimately settling in with a 63 in the second round. Stewart Sink at 13, par five, Second shot, 232 yards, and this one just landing right on top of the flag. And he would make a two-putt birdie from there. Kramer Hickok, looking for a share of the lead, fired the 63 in the opening round. Opening hole in the second day of play, and he holds the birdie. So that gets him to eight under, now at 11. 23 feet, looking for the solo lead. And Kramer Hickok bidding for his first tour title. Sinks that, and he would be out in front. Patrick Reed, par four 15. Drivable par four. His tee shot all the way to the back of the green, and then back to a front pin as he drops it in for an eagle two. Huge putt for Reed. Jason Day, eight under, looking for a share of the lead. That's in at nine under, and Day would ultimately get to nine under at day's end, looking to contend. 